I mean, that's old school right there, you guys. Joe. I mean, everybody like a little Joe. And that one with his call, give me more and more. Mm. Yeah, I mean, I, Joe was, I was riding with that one, you uh -huh. guys. He wants more. More yeah. and more. He's asking. Baby making music. <laughs> yeah. That's how I was here. Hello. <laughs> and that's what we're missing in society. Do you know that back in the days, we used to like to go out and slow dance. For sure. I mean, we love to go there and social. We call it social. Mm -hmm. You know, hey, baby, can I get this dance? You know what I'm saying? And he, we were slow drag. But nowadays, he danced with his boys. She danced with her girls. I mean, they have took the, they don't even dim the lights no more. My stepmom used to say that. Wow. My stepmom, she used to, you know, she would tell me all the time about, you know, different music and everything. And she was like, you know, yeah. back in the day, you know, um, we, male artists, they would, you know, they would romance a woman. Right. You know, they would romance a woman. Chivalry, so. like, you know. Chivalry, yeah. yeah. Where's yeah, that at, guys? Yeah. Yeah. They said it's dead because I'm telling you, what, gangster rap kicked in. Gangster rap, when it kicked in, a lot of, you know what I'm saying, from a woman being called a woman like a lady, they got the name got changed to all this gangster rap stuff and all this craziness. Well, it, it just it just depends on the woman because we also got to understand that there's many different types of women out there. Every woman isn't a lady. That's right. So when they talk mm. about a certain yeah, different, yeah, when yeah. they talk about a certain type of woman, we're yeah. not talking about all women. We exactly. talk about a certain woman. Mm. Right. You know what I'm saying? All so in the that's, videos, that's you know. yeah, all in the videos, <laughs> dancing around. <laughs> Every, every come city. to come to <laughs> wait a minute. Every other city we go. <laughs> every other video. <laughs> Please, we you know can't say the rest. That's hey. right. You, you know that's a class. You know that's a classic for real. For real. You, you know that's you know, what doggy style. Uh, no, no, that's, that's Tupac. Tupac. That's Tupac. Yeah. Oh, that's Tupac. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. My fault. I'm uh, thinking uh, of Snoop Dogg. All eyes on me. Yeah, all eyes on it. me. Yeah, but you yeah, know. but but we just don't understand. Like the, you can't distinguish from whom they're speaking about. So right. we just feel it's all women. Yeah. I mean, I personally don't like when men call women H or the B. Right. I don't even do it myself. Right. And so I when they do that, it's a turn off, and I don't even want to be your friend. Mm -hmm. So that's like things like if you have that capability of speaking like that to people, it bothers me. Right. You know you, what I mean? You I know what? I, I, I feel the same thing when people talk about like Latinos or, you know, say anything with labels on them. Because I, I look at them and I say, well, we're not really Latinos because the Latinos were the colonizers. That, you okay. know, we they were the colonizers. You know, we, we aren't, haven't been taught. I'm saying what I'm saying about America. They haven't taught nobody no. nothing about nobody races. And you know, back you know in, in TV shows, it's been races where they they speak, uh, they, they they talk bad down. They look down on every other race, but white race. Um, you know, what I'm saying Latino. You know, they they you know how you you know some people don't have good English, and they come in, they make fun of the English. You know, it's and just, a, a lot of times it's just hate. They it just you just don't. Kids keep it real. You're a little jealous. You can't speak multiple languages. Yeah. Let's mm -hmm. just keep it real. You're a little jealous that other, other people can speak with each other and you're kind of lost. Uh -huh. Other countries speak multiple languages. We're the only one that's a problem with speaking another language. Well, that's just going to keep you suppressed. China is saying the suppressed. United States is the most racist, racist in the nation. In the nation. Yes. That China just released China this. China said, man, they are China so just released what? Say that again? They, they just released this and they said that America is the worst race. In the world, in it's the, the racist world. Uh, uh, country in the and world. And they had a comic strip of the Statue of Liberty with a gun shooting at the people. Mm. I mean, that's th deep, guys. And and you know what? It's true. We're based off of racism. Right. Mm -hmm. We were created and but, killed off But I off didn't know. Others. Wait a minute, but it's race and everything. Absolutely. I didn't know uh, Dominicans, uh, uh, the the, uh, uh, the Puerto Ricans. They are light skinned than the uh that's what I heard than Dominicans and that, it's, no that's it, not it, true it, that doesn't wait wait wait, wait 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 no let me finish uh, and then because I heard wrong some, there's different colors and all different races okay because so, I heard some Democrat uh uh, 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 uh uh you know help me out let, let me let me let me let me help let me help you out no, there the historian right here you're, you're okay wrong with that so thing. you got you got you got Boricuas uh -huh. you got Ticas those Cubans. You know, Dominicans. Dominican. That's why I was Dominicans. Dominicans. Okay. Dominicans. So all of us is mixed with three nations. Okay. And that's first indigenous nation, the Tainos and the Arawak. That's mm -hmm. Indian. That's Indian. Okay. Indigenous. Then it comes the Spanish who colonized everybody. Mm -hmm. They came. Oh. And then they brought Africans from West Africa to Central Africa, and they brought them there. Uh -huh. Everybody who is Puerto Rican, Dominican, Cuban, Haitian, they all have African blood in them. Gotcha. Okay. Uh -huh. So 
when you hear of a Puerto Rican say, oh, I'm not Puerto Rican, or I mean, I'm not black, yeah. I don't have black in me, or you have Dominicans say, I'm not black, uh -huh. yes, you are. Or they say they're not white, but we are all three. Mixed. We are. We are all three, but if you look at it, if you look at it, the actual, like, if you look what a wasp is, you know what a wasp is? Okay, what is that? A wasp, that's an acronym for white, Anglin, Saxon, Protestant. Okay. The English who came over here, because before it was the Spanish and the Portuguese who came over here. When the English came, they brought their ways from over to America. Yes. So the 50 states, the 50, United States, mm -hmm. the 50 states uh -huh. are actually modeled by England. Okay. So when you have somebody who is a real racist, uh -huh. that means not only that they don't like you because of your skin color, they don't like you because of your religion. Right. They don't like you because of this. They don't like you because of that. That's what I was getting back when the first time when I was talking about the KKK. Okay. The first KKK started not liking blacks because of their financial and um growth. Right. Their financial growth. Yeah. After Reconstruction of the South. Uh -huh. The second wave started when the Europeans from Eastern Eastern Europeans started to come over there. You know, they didn't like Italians. Mm -hmm. They they deemed Italians as, you know, the N-word of uh, the uh, European nations because Italians are mixed with African ancestry. Same with Spanish. You right. know, you if you look at back in history, the Moors, mm -hmm. the Moors, you know, North Africans, they conquered. There's 20% of the population in Spain right now are Muslim. Mm -hmm. Right. And people don't know in Africa, it was a group of tribe that was called niggas. Nigas, oh. it was called Nigas. Uh, yeah, Nigas. Nigas. But, uh, you know, you know. You, you, you got, you got to do, name, you got, right? you got to say with the Nig accent, yeah, Nigas. Nigas. Yeah. But, you know what I'm but saying? But it was, and so that's why when they brought them over here, uh, they called them Nigas. Let me, let me, let me, let me interject real quick, Gosh. and I'm, let me interject real quick. I'm, I'm gonna say this real quick. I learned this from a history professor. Okay, my African American history professor. Shout out to um, uh, Edmonds, Good Dr. Job. Edmonds. He, he's the one that taught me. I was like his teacher pet. Wow. Okay. Okay, so he said there was a scientific reason why Africans were selected for Af uh, for slavery. Uh huh. The reason why was because, for one, in the United States, um, just only talking about the United States, just right now. Um, if you look at regions like Florida, if you Hot. look at region like Georgia, Texas, not even Texas, but w let's focus on the East Coast first. Okay. Well, so we're talking about Florida, Georgia, South Carolina, south. North Carolina, okay. dirty South. Did you know that people who live around the Mediterranean, they have the sickle cell trait? Okay. And that's not, you know, that's including Italians mm -hmm. and people from Greek descent. You know, they have the sickle cell trait. And they the sickle cell trait. Heat. Yeah. This is, the, actually, the sickle cell trait actually gives you certain immunities to certain diseases like malaria. Mm -hmm. So when you actually come to places like North and South America, I mean, uh, North and South Carolina, what they don't tell you is, the population was predominantly black. It was the black majority. There's a book that I read called The Black Majority. Mm -hmm. The slave masters didn't even live in North and South Carolina. They lived in Virginia. Okay. And they had black overseers overseeing their property. They would come like every once a week, every once a month, right. checking everything like that. That's number one. Because they were making money off of their plantations. Yeah, they was. So they can go anywhere. So they just left and they were like, we'll just leave it to them, you know, come back and see what's up. The second one was actually the fact that uh, because of malaria, mosquitoes, they carry malaria. So at that time, white people didn't like the heat. They didn't like the swamp. They didn't like the mosquitoes because they carried malaria. Uh -huh. Because you had the sickle cell trait or the sickle cell uh, you know, trait, you was immune to malaria. Second, uh, Africans from the uh, west coast of Africa, their um, culture was cultivating the land. So me, you, and her could have all um, a family but we each individual have our own little crops that we do. And what we do is we spread it to not only ourselves, but through the whole nation or our whole, you know, tribe, the, you know, right, share with farmers. everything. Right. So when they came to an America and they tried to enslave the Native Americans, they couldn't do that because they didn't understand that the men went to hunt and the women did the uh, cultivating. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, so they didn't understand that. So when they couldn't do that, then they had indentured servants, which indentured servants was, you know, it was servitude. But at the same time, they had time to get out and buy properties and everything like that. So there was a scientific reason why Africans was, you know, selected for slavery. It's messed up, mm -hmm. but it's crazy. And that's yeah. only talking about the English uh, colonization. Not and even they were strong. About the they was like a lot of them strong. They can work the crops and, yeah. you know, and yeah. uh, 
And the way they controlled them was crazy. We got to talk about this at another time. Absolutely. We're going to bring him back on. We're going to yeah. talk about black history. Or just history, American That's history. It. Because it ain't just black history. It's Spanish history. It's all. It's, it's American history. We, yeah. all, we are all the same nation. And I'm going to say this for everyone to hear so we can... Cut all the, uh, cut all the um, prejudice and yeah. the nonsense and everything. Blacks, the so-called blacks, so-called Native Americans, the so-called Boriguas, Dominicans, Cubans, Mexicans. We are all the same people. We yeah. got the same ancestry. That's when right. I see another yeah. Mexican, I don't look at him as a Mexican. I look at him as another brother. Right. Just like I look at somebody from Africa and I look at him as another brother. Hmm. What? The biggest movement right now is what people don't understand is they're talking about that black people or the original Native Americans, which some of that could be true. Because if you don't know, back in history, there was Native Americans who looked more black. And because of the reconstruction, when they had um, the Indian removal, it was taboo for you to say that you was indigenous. So you had to pick a side. If you look more black. You had to go in your senses to say you was black. Yeah, if you look more white, you had to go and say in the senses that you was white. So when people say that, well, the Africans are more, you know, the act so-called um, African-Americans are the original Native Americans. That could be true for some people, Uh huh. you know. So That's y'all so. keep it locked right here to Peace on the Street. That's we got to get a song on. Peace on and the we're going to wrap this part up, you guys. Hurricane Are we can. trying to drop hey. some uh, knowledge on you guys mm-hmm. right here on Peace on the Street? So mm-hmm. Chris, it doesn't matter. We'll all come in different colors and different shapes. Yeah. Oh! Yeah, you better believe it. It's been a great show. It's been a great show. Thank you all for tuning in to Peace on the Radio Show. Oh! I'm your host, Prince of the South. You all right, Mimi? I'm good. <laughs> rap star, is, is this mic on? Because I saw yeah, it kind of low. Yeah, rap star? Yeah. Rap star, you got to give out your shout outs. Thank you so much for being with us live. Shout out to uh, Veronica Gonzalez, uh, Vero G Spotlight Magazine for putting me on last month's issue. Wow. Shout out to Jackie Brown. Shout out to um, Beverly Bush. Shout out to um, Drac. Shout out to Mimi. Shout out to Peace on the Streets Radio for hooking up with the kid. Yeah. You know, it's all crazy, man. Shout out to my boy Rich. Shout out to my boy Lorenzo. Shout out to my boy Leroy. Shout out to my dad, Leonard, for getting me all up in this. Shout out to Tina. Shout out to my baby sister, Ariel. Shout out to my big sister, Tamika. Uh Can't forget her. (laughs) She won't let me, she won't let me live it down. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody who's been rocking with the kid. You know, I've been doing this for a long time. You know, so uh, when when I was on Facebook and Twitter and everything, I received so much love just for coming out here. Wow. You know, so uh, everybody who reached out and, and really cared about the kid, you know, talking about safe trips and safe journeys and proud of you and everything. I, I like to, you know, shout y'all out. Can't forget. True Live, shout out to True Live for hooking me up with DMX. You know you my wow. man's. Shout out to um, Sonny Brasco for mixing and recording my records. You know, you know I love you, bro. For real, you know. Um, I want to say the whole East Coast rap star because <laughs> seriously, the fans that you have is impressive. They get in, they share your posts, they send comments, and they follow the ones that you support. That's deep. So big shout out to your fans. That they're amazing. They actually talk to me. Yeah, shout, shout, yeah. shout out to the whole East, shout out to the whole East Coast. Actually, you know, shout out to Boston, shout out to New York, shout out to Pittsburgh, shout Come out on. to Florida. I even gotta go out West Coast. I gotta shout out, you know, Los Angeles. I gotta shout out, you know, California. I gotta shout out to Inglewood, Rich. What's up? I gotta shout out to Texas. I gotta shout out to New Mexico. All my indigenous people from Seminoles to Tainos. Hey. Shout out to um shout out to my man's Eduardo. Shout out to Elvis. Shout yeah. out to everybody who's supporting the black and brown and red movement. I mean, I got the shirt on. I got the Young Lords. If y'all don't know about the Young Lords, you know they are a political group who worked hand in hand with the Black Panthers and they Puerto Rican. So we talking about the Black Panthers and the Young Lord and also talking about the Red Power Movement. So shout out to all my indigenous people. If you guys want to know your history, reach out to Rap Star. Yeah, reach out to me, man. He I'll, gets in. I'll tell you. He yeah. gets in. So huge shout out again to Nurse V. Thank you for being with us on the updates every week. 
to give us for coronavirus because we need this. That's Nurse right. Feet, thank you so much for your time. Yes. Miss Angela, thank you so much for being with us, for your trust, for your loyalty, for helping us as well make this movement. Uh -huh. We love being with the organization. So big shout out to Miss it's, it's a, <laughs> Miss International <laughs> World yeah. and Miss Latina International. Again, guys, thank you for being with us on WOKB Radio. Don't forget, you can still donate as we're going FM, baby. Yeah. Yeah. WOKBRadio.com. Go to the right-hand side. Donate anything matters guys thank you for being with us you know what i'm gonna say the saddest thing is wasted talent mm -hmm. don't waste the gift that god has given you go full force don't let fear or intimidation stop you but that's not just orlando yes. no you uh -huh. hey you guys we'll be back on again next week from 9 to 11 you guys the smooth r&b jam with your girl me me mala and your boy prince of the south Right here on Peace on the Street, WOKB, we love you. 1680 for allowing us to do what we do right here on Peace on the Streets. A rap star, we appreciate you, brother. God bless and you. And your fiance, and thank you. Shout out man. to STL, Miss STL. Shout out to STL in the whole, you know, um, um, California radio station. I forgot my radio station. Right here my radio street, station. Shout out, shout out to All Talk No Filter. Mr. That's my Ramsey. radio station. What up? What up? Big shout out to Mr. Ramsey. Thank you for being with us in the mirror. Peace on the street. Oh.